It is September 25th. I'm Mark Peterson. Our weather coverage continues with, uh, again, air quality index in the moderate, looking to probably stay there, so a little bit of haze. We're going to get a little rain this morning in the morning, but then it's going to be warm with cloud cover and some gusty southeast winds. 75 will be our high today. We'll expect tonight to, again, have mostly cloudy, light rain, 52 degrees for the overnight low, but still some gusty southwest winds to 20 miles an hour. Here are the rain chances starting on Tuesday. That's really going to be the, the start of uh, the rainy conditions. We're going to get bands of rain coming in, and that takes us all the way through the end of the week. We have a less chance over the weekend. So we're looking for forecast rain over the next uh, couple of days that really is not going to amount to a lot. It's going to be, again, a quarter of an inch potentially. We're looking at 14 hundreds by the time we get through Wednesday and then more bands of rain coming in. So about a quarter of an inch expected over the next several days. The four-day forecast radar calls for a few morning showers. Should be dry at 5 o'clock. But then we see that band coming in tonight overnight. Get a bit of a break Tuesday. Then we get uh, more coming in on Wednesday. Then that hangs around. We get a bit of a break and then we have more on Thursday. And that's sort of what's going to happen with these bands coming off of this low. And then we'll see more on Friday. So that's sort of the setup, and that forecast rainfall really is going to be the Cascades, really going to be the higher elevations, and then we'll see it continue to just march its way through um, with the heavier amounts of rain into the mountains of the Cascades. And, of course, in some of the burn scar areas, there's the potential for some flooding. Uh, we'll have temperatures today that are going to be into the mid-70s and then upper 70s as we look at Coeur d'Alene, Kellogg, St. Mary's, um, Bonners Ferry, 75, Sandpoint right there in the mid-70s. So things are looking pretty good. Not too shabby. But look at Omak and Grand Coulee. Usually warmer. Now they've got 70 and 73 with 62 into winter. So cooler air is going to start marching in. Lewiston, this heat before the cold, 88 degrees today. Now let's take a look at that planning forecast. While we do have uh, 75 today and breezy, uh, we do have the diminished air quality that should improve tomorrow with, again, some of the clouds and a mix coming in because right now the wind's coming out of the southeast. It is going to be rainy. The first alert weather app would be perfect to have in your tool chest on your phone so you can see when the rain is going to be happening. And it is going to get cooler. All right, we'll continue with more weather coming up.